We're now going to uh, work with the intro and here uh, there are uh, two details that we need to give some attention before we play it all together. And the first one is something that you would see on several places in the song, um, if not every time an E minor moves to a G. They are connected with a little bass line going that's at the end on the, of the bar on the 4, so we, the detail is this, 3, 4, 2, 3, and then you're on a G. Uh, so with the arpeggiation, my arpeggiation suggestion, uh, it sounds like this, 3, 4, and then it's going to continue. To the other chords so you're gonna first first gonna do this uh, so you get one with video with just this particular motion uh, and then there's another detail uh, uh, towards the end of the intro where we have a C that moves to a G slash B and then to an A minor uh, and this is uh, this is just simply arpe arpeggiation uh, uh, but just so you know it, uh, when you go to a G, you, the only thing you have to do is to move the middle finger up one string because you're only going to arpeggiate the fifth, fourth, and third strings. And fifth and the fourth and third strings of a G is are open, and then it's going to move on to an A minor. So uh, what you're going to practice in that video is uh, this, three, four. So, and those are the two details, so you will get uh, a separate video of detail one, detail two, and then you're going to put together the entire intro right now.
à Caen. Ah,